Yes, my friends, slavery helped to build Rome and it simultaneously helped to destroy Rome. Or at least build it into an image that actually hurt the majority of its population. And let me explain. There are a lot of arguments against slavery in history. But usually people nowadays think along more of the moral lines and not the economic lines. Which was the real major problem in Rome? See, back in Rome, the economics of slavery meant that as the empire grew and it acquired more and more slaves who were pushed onto farms and into mines that made people fabulously wealthy. We're talking about a very few wealthy individuals here, like senators and whatnot, not the general population. All of this free labor on these massive farms ended up outcompeting the people who were the small farmers who had farmed land for literally generations. The now destitute former farmers of Rome had to be herded into the cities where they would live off of the welfare of the state, as the size of Rome of over a million people was only possible thanks to the fact that 200,000 of its adult male citizens were being given large amounts of bread directly from the state. They were dependent upon welfare.